Hello engineers of space, this is Sausage Fingers and welcome to the Space Engineers. Right, in our last, as you can see, I made a few little upgrades to my base. Well, a lot of upgrades. I took my rover out, I'd done a couple of mining runs, filled it right up to the top. The suspension, as I thought, was too low. Um, smashed the front off of the vehicle, there was a few explosions and I actually got stuck into a hole. I came over this hill too fast and basically dug myself into the ground. Yes. Um, there was a small fire, nobody was hurt, but I had to actually dig myself out. It's quite a good hole though, isn't it? Yes, very impressed. Mm. To that end, I have upgraded the suspension a little bit. I've put more power in my base, so the battery charges in about 30 seconds flat. I've got solar panels now, all of the solar panels. I don't know why they're only getting three of the solar, because the sun's right there, but never mind. Mm. Never mind. Last time, I built a groundy collecty thing. This time, I want to build a flying collecty thing. But this time, I want my flying collecty thing to have drills on it, so that I don't even have to get out of my vehicle to do the collecty thing. Yes, what could possibly go wrong? Hmm. Wrong. Have some of them bitter. Uh, don't need any of them, need loads of them. Some of them bitter. One of them, and a little bit of that, just in case. And we're in. Plop, there we go. Right, I've got an idea in my head this time on how I want this to look. It's going to be a flying sausage saucer. I want six um, thrusters, yes. So, wow, that is a very cool shape, but I cannot even say how long that took me. Yeah, that is ridiculous. I need flashing lights on this. It's a flying saucer, damn it. Right, I've got my two batteries stuck in there. Now I want two O2 hydrogen generator thingies somewhere. Um, and I want one hydrogen tank somewhere. I'm not sure if I need an oxygen tank or not, but I'm going to whop one in anyway. Because why not? Okay, people, I finally finished it. This took me a lot longer than I would care to admit. And here she is. I've saved the game under Sausage's test flight. I've just filled it up with ice. The hydrogen tanks are just filling up. We've got a few little gadgets and gizmos on here that I haven't played with before, like pistons and stuff. Yeah, it was hard setting all this lot up. Um... I don't actually know why I've put engines on. I don't think I need them in case I need to charge my battery. That's my excuse. Right, I've got two parachutes on it. For not if, but when we come plummeting towards the Earth. I know what I haven't put on it, and that's an ore detector. Hmm, I need an ore detector. Look, I built it with none of the problems. Not even one of the problems. Yes, I've got to drill on this. Again, the drill pack's a little surprise. Hydrogen thrusters. These are different in the fact that you have to have them in a conveyor system. So the conveyor system is going inside to the hydrogen tank. I so don't want to look at this anymore. It's butt ugly. But it's mine and it's butt ugly. Yes. So we've got atmospheric thrusters for the atmosphere. We should stop, stop gaining altitude and then I know to kick in these thrusters, the hydrogen thrusters, um, before we go into space. Uh, no, let's just go into space. <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? What else have I got on me? I've got loads of stuff on me. So I'm going to put it back. I'm not going to put it in there though. I'm going to put it in here. I wanted that ice and that. That's my emergency ice for when it all goes pear-shaped. Like I said, these parachutes should work like a charm. This is our first test flight, people. Um, I'm going to turn on the battery. Four. I'm going to turn on the atmosphere, atmospheric thrusters with one. I have grouped them the same as I did in the last group. I'm going to disconnect from the connector. And now I should be able to zoom in and look at this little bad boy. Yeah. Right. The landing gear is above the bottom, you say. I hear you say that. Whoa, the brakes ain't that great. 
But it's not a problem because look! Look at the thing! Yes! A retractable landing gear. I am so happy with that. That is well cool. Mmm! Retractable. Now, let's go inside. Look at my drill. It doesn't go out far enough, I hear you say. But... No, that's not it. It's, uh, eighth. Yeah! Go on, me. I'm so proud of myself. This is the ugliest ship I've ever seen, but it took me a lot of work. Um, I will show you something. If you go into G and block tools and drag that down, then if you left click, you will drill and you collect the automatic you collect resources automatically. It automatically goes into your cargo. As long as it's set up with conveyor. If you right click, you just dig holes. Exactly the same as you do in like the first person body type thing. So, I'm going to retract my drill. I shouldn't really hang about. I don't know how long I've got power-wise. We're going to go straight up, because that's where space is. Let's go there. Core, it's got a good bit of lift. I know I'm as aerodynamic as a brick, but I just don't care. Sounds awesome. Look at me being a space engineer. I fitted an air tank to this as well, an oxygen tank, and set it up on a conveyor to the cockpit. So hopefully I will be able to breathe. I have not tested this theory. I don't know if I will be able to breathe or not. I don't think you hit space till about 20,000 meters or something crazy like that. My speed's coming right down now. Well. I'm starting to slow down quite a bit. I'm going to smash on me other thrusters. Bosh! And me speed's back up. Me gravity's actually going down on the bottom right. 0.92 with a G now. I might. Yeah. I'm turning off my dampeners. I'm going to kind of feather my throttle and see if... I don't know if that works or not. If it'll save me any ice. I came up with practically a full load of ice. Just to see if I could take off with it. So if I pick up ores when we're up here, I should be able to bring them back. And everything. Look, look how far away we are. We should be all right getting back because gravity is great. There's another planet over there. Or is it a moon? That's no moon. Um, how high am I? Where am I? Am I still going up? I turned my HUD off, didn't I? 20,000 metres nearly. 0.28 of a G. It's getting loud in here. Um, Jesus, this is actually quite scary. <laughs> um, I'm, I'm actually quite worried. I hope I can get back. Let's check our inventory. Um, ship's inventory... I've still got loads in my cargo container. We're burning next to nothing here. I've bought oxygen bottles with me just in case, but I've still got my visor open. So that oxygen tank thing really works. 0.2 of a G. I don't know if we're in space yet. I don't think we are. Oh, we are so nearly in space. I hope I don't catch on fire or anything. I think we've nearly done it, people. Look at that. That looks really good from the top. I'm pretty happy with that, actually. That looks nice. Let's go up some more. When do we start seeing asteroids? There's one. There's another one. Ooh. You know what's up here, people? Uranium. Yeah, I've made a right old boo-boo with that light, and I put it in there. It's not giving me... Uh-oh. I'll put my visor down. That will help. Well, we know how our in-ship thingy works now, then. I'm going to take this off, I think. Or is it? It is on. What could possibly go wrong building in space, eh?
Whoa! Well, that's what happens if you turn the, the jetpack off then. Cool, you it lasts ages in space. It's not even going down. I suppose that makes sense, just dampeners, innit? I'm going to have to pop this here. There, should be able to see a bit better now. Might even need it right on the front. I'm gonna get my drill out. Let's go and look at this rock. Actually using oxygen as well now. That is really good. I think I've found the only rock with nothing in it. Ouch. I have, haven't I? I've found a blooming rock with nothing in it. Alright, let's go to the next rock. Oh, this is exciting times this. Please let me find something before I go home. But even if I don't, I'm not bothered because this works. It's got to be something in these rocks. That's something there. It's got to be. Do you know what? I turn that on. I'm going K. Or detector. The block is on. Ugh. I've got an antenna as well. It's only got a 50 metre range on it. What is this? Why isn't my all detector? Have I done something wrong? Why isn't my all detector picking this up? Nickel? Nickel? I want stinky nickel. Right, if anyone could let me know why my all detector's not working, that would be amazing. It's really not. Oh! Baddies! 16 kilometers away. I've got no weapons on this ship at all. This ship is not a ship of pew pew. It is a ship of drill drill. Yes. Um, I'm going to do my visor. I'm going to get out. Let's go and have a little look for ourselves. There's got to be something in here. Tunnel. Uranium. Oh, you little beauty. It's here. It's here. It don't look like there's a lot. Oh, how dark is it? it I've got lights on. Doesn't it know this? Where's my patch of uranium gone? Is, was this it? Uh, health low. Oh, poo. Just crashed into something. Right, I'm going to go K. GPS. New from current position. Uranium. Turn all them off. Yeah, I want the holding platform on still. I want to try out my drill. That's what I want to do. I want to know if... I... Oh, I thought that was a ship. I can't see what that is. I'm really disappointed in that scanner thing. That's ice. I need ice too. We can check, shall we? Yeah, let's get drilling, people. Seven. No, not seven. Uh, eight. Not the 
most effective drilling the well, but it's doing the job. However, I did get quite a bit. Jesus, I've got loads. My storage is full already. Alright, fair one. I got tons. Um, I'm going in a space cave. What could possibly go wrong? There it is. The uranium. Dark in here, innit? Right, I've been doing that for about three seconds. And I haven't got a lot. Turn my dampers off, see if I can save some H2. Space mining. I think we are now officially classified as a space engineer. Yeah! I'm actually really looking forward to the re entry. I have no idea what's going to happen. I kind of want to test out my parachutes. I kind of want it to go wrong, but I don't want to lose this ship now. Mmm, refinery. You're eating well tonight. This is an absolute mining, uh, nightmare mining by hand. Wait. Oh, we need to retract our drill. Yes, we do. With the eight key, retract. Now, if I get up to full speed, turn my dampers off, we should start getting gravity back. Planet. I'm going to try and turn what we got. We got 0.07 of a G. I'm turning my thrusters off. Yeah, that's right. Off. I've actually got spare parachutes as well. I've connected the parachutes up to a conveyor system. So in the cockpit, I've got spare ones. So if I fire these off, they should save me and then you can only use them once and then I've got spares I might try them when I get a bit lower yeah what could possibly go wrong we'll pretend for a minute our engines have failed what key is it? 9 I've changed the view I'm going to zoom out a little bit and I'm going to press 9 oh you little dancer look at that they're not doing a lot are they? Am I still too high? Uh oh. Uh oh. They're not very open, are they? Oh, here we go, here we go. Oh, we can't possibly they look like a pair of. What's it? <laughs> we are safe as houses. Right, I'm going to drop them. How do I drop them? I can't drop them. Um. Press nine again. I can't ditch them. How do I ditch them? Oh well, we're going in nice. I wonder if you can't ditch them till you hit the ground. Uh, let's try a different toolbar. Yeah, that works. Uh, three. No, wrong toolbar. Ah! That. That nearly went bad, didn't it? <laughs> 
we do these things so you don't have to. I can turn my hydrogen thrusters off now, hopefully. And I'm going to turn my dampeners back on. That's why we plummeted. This thing handles really well. Oh, I love it. I love it. That's it. We are free. We can do what we want. Flare off some speed. There we go. We're on. Now I press P to connect. Going to my different view. Now I can turn my engines off and I can turn my batteries to auto, which will recharge them. Yeah. My inventory should be unloading my uranium. It's done already. Hmm. Well, spare parachutes for next time. That nearly went very, very wrong. Go on, my little refinery. goes down slowly, doesn't it? And what can I build with the uranium? I can build a warhead. I've seen a friend use them, they are epic. They make very big holes. Oh, a welder. I, I could have already have done that. Now that's what we're after, people, the reactors. I can make one now. And a jump drive. I can make a jump drive. Yeah. Gravity generators. From a progression standpoint, in vanilla, we are practically done. Yeah. I can make everything now. Now that I've got that uranium. Oh no, I need platinum as well. And then we can say we're done. So our next time we'll think, I think, be a return trip to space in the little beauty. What should we name it? It is ugly, isn't it? Let's look at this thing again. Look at that. By God, it's ugly, but by God, it's good. Same as that. I am rubbish at building things, aren't I? Never mind. They work. That was a lot of fun. I've been a space. I am a space sausage. I am so saving this blueprint. I think, yeah, it's control B, isn't it? Save the blueprint. I love it. It's growing on me. It like looks like a bulldog, doesn't it? Bulldog chewing a wasp. Horrible looking ship. But, but it, it works. It works. I will see you soon, everybody. Thank you so much. I hope you enjoyed that. If you did, give us a like and a subscribe. Thank you a lot to my patrons who enable me to carry on doing this. I will see you soon, everybody. Laters.